Hello, this is Turok5011, and today I'm going to show you how to make a animated GIF in Photoshop. So, first thing you want to do is you want to start a new composition. Any size is fine. And after that, what you want to do is um, get your bucket tool right there and fill it any color you want. I'm choosing black, but you don't have to choose any of that. You can just choose any color you want. Now get your text tool. And write whatever you want, so. Move it to where you want. And once you're done, center it to where you like it. Um, it looks fine for me. And um, after that, what you want to do is go to Window, Animation, and you should get this little window right here. Um, what we're going to do right now is we're going to um, hide the admin and the Cali style graphics layer and just work with this one right now so um, go here and you want to set the opacity to about set it to zero and um as you see there's nothing there what you're gonna do is click on this click on the three lines like right there and new frame and you want to bring the opacity up little by little so you see it's like you can barely see it which is fine for right now so you want to create a new frame again raise it a little bit more new frame keep raising it new frame New frame. So what you got right now is something that looks like this. But you see it's going way too fast. So I'm going to teach you how to slow it down later in the video. So just keep watching. Now that you have that, now that you have the Turok 5011 layer all animated, you're done with this one, you want to go to Calistyle Graphics and you want to set the opacity to zero on this one as well. So you can't see the Calistyle Graphics layer. Now, bring it up a little by little. New frame. You can bring it up new frame I mean this is easy once you get the hang of it so if you don't get it the first time just keep trying and trying it and you, you will get the hang of it keep bringing the opacity up new frame let's bring it all the way up um, now, the last layer, I'm going to make that visible, and you want to set the opacity to about 8 on this one, and 
do frame again. Um, new frame. Keep bringing the opacity up. Um, new frame. frame and that's why I good now if you did it right you should get something like this but as you see it's going way too fast um, to slow it down you want to see the bottom it, it says zero seconds I'm going to right click it and set it to point two on all of them so point two point two point two and so forth. And it should look like this when you're done. And yeah, that's about it. You can do more stuff with it, and like, I mean, you can add a glow to the name. Um, I can give you a little example. Um, go to blending options, and you want to have a outer glow. To um, bring up the menu, the menu for um, the outer glow, just click on the thing, and you want to have to spread just a little bit out in size like that. And basically, you just create new frames and just bring the spread and the size up little by little. So I got a new frame. Now you want to keep going to blending options. If you didn't know how to get to blending options, just right click and blending options um... go back to outer glow new frame So we're gonna bring the glow back down to where you can barely see it. So what you want to do is create a new create a new frame, right click and do blending options again. And step go in the opposite direction. So new frame, blending options. And you should get something like this. And that's how you get an animated GIF signature for um, your form. And one last thing um, you should check out our website. It's called Cali Style Graphics. And, um, yeah, it's a pretty awesome form. We have different things here like tutorials, signatures, PSDs, renders, docs, fonts, everything. We have C4Ds too. Um, yeah, so we have all different kinds of stuff. We have general talk talk about anything you want to talk about um, you have music games movies and 
yep, that's about it. Um, thanks for watching, and look forward to my next video.